Hey everyone, we're The Introduction. We're a rock group from Omaha, Nebraska. I am Ashton. I do uh, vocals um, and drums. I'm Laura, I play bass guitar. I'm Abby, I do lead vocals. I'm Logan, I do piano and guitar. Uh, I'm Jagger, I do guitar and sometimes I sing. So we formed in 2018 at Logan's 14th birthday party, uh, but they didn't join the band until May 2019. Um, so we were like, we didn't even have a lead singer for like seven or eight months. Yeah, it was just kind of like instrumental yeah. stuff. Two keyboards. Yeah, <laughs> we, had, yeah. Keyboards we had two and, keyboards, and guitar, and a guitar. And a yeah. very bad guitar player. <laughs> uh, yeah, our music, we kind of play all over the rock genre, but we don't really stick to any specific thing. Yeah, it depends on, it yeah. depends on who who's writing the song. song. Yeah, it's kind of a blend of whatever, because you like making more acoustic sort of folk things, and Jagger's into like punk, indie. indie um, we all kind of bring something yeah. different to the table. Yeah. We currently are in the process of recording uh, an EP, five, five original songs, uh, and I think our goal is to have it like released sometime around the end of May. Yeah, like 2021. At least, at least before the summertime. So the EP we're working on right now has got five songs. We've been working on them for around over two years. The first one that we wrote is a song called Searchlights, and Logan really wrote that whole song. <laughs> yeah, we kind of yeah, just added everything yeah. else to it, and it just got bigger and bigger and bigger. It's changed it a hard. lot through the time that it's existed. Yeah. yeah. And then Abby and Ashton wrote the lyrics for that song and most of the songs we have on it. I don't think any of us have written no lyrics. <laughs> it's weird, with Searchlights, I wrote pretty much all the lyrics for that when I was like on the phone. Yeah. The hardest part is coming up with a theme for what the song should be about. Because once you get that, it's pretty easy to stick with it and finish the song. But coming up with that is the hardest part. Yeah. And like a lot of the songs, Logan's like written the foundation of it. So that's how they all kind of work together nicely is because he sort of given us like, here's a piano part for maybe a minute and a half. Let's make this a whole song. And then me and Laura will spice it up with some guitar and bass and then Ashton will make the drum parts. We yeah. kind of, we usually come up with a melody unless like the melody's part of the piano. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we finally got them all down the way. They don't um, want them all to yeah. And then we're actually, spe speaking of finally finishing something, we've, you know, this final band <laughs> name, yeah. we've, we've had, had Maybe five or six band names. Oh, no, no. 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 <laughs> five, 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 five or six official no, names. No, we've had like 10. Okay, 10. <laughs> like, like 500 and, ideas. Yeah, yeah. way more, more than that. They've all been bad. Yeah, they were they, all... They've all been pretty bad. So the first show we did was, I think it had all of the songs off this EP. Except for... You know they did. Yeah, they actually, had all of them on the EP, just extremely different. Like they were all, none of them sure. sound. Yeah. The only one that even sounds remotely similar is probably Nostalgia, which is yeah. Searchlights. But we yeah. 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 we they still changed quite a bit. Yeah. But Ashton's song, his newest song that he's written, that was just an uh, instrumental song, and it was a lot yeah. more rock, very rock very, very than different than what it is now. And then and then the next show after we did that was at the Sumter Amphitheater this last summer and we did we did all covers for that show because i don't think i mean we, we were still ironing out the few bits and pieces of our originals nothing was i don't think any of our songs were set in stone at that point no. so we had a lot of covers that we had learned that we really wanted to because mm -hmm. during for people during quarantine this last year we we had planned on making maybe a cover album so we had we had a, a good four or five songs in yeah. our back pocket and then this opportunity came up through Ashton's drum studio which is uh, Papillion House of Music in Papillion which is a part of like the sub area of Omaha. Mm -hmm. It's kind of where we operate. Yeah. Uh, Ashton's, Ashton's house is in Papillion so we practice here because it has drums. Yeah. That's how we got that. into the band kind of because we're sisters. Yeah we're twins and he's our cousin. Yes. So, and we're actually extremely close. Yeah. Like, we, yeah. I don't think there's been more than like, we're the longest we've siblings. ever been away, like with, the, ever, we've ever gone without seeing each other was like a month. Yeah. yeah so, but, so we had just like started learning, you know, acoustic guitar and I started learning bass guitar after Christmas. And I was like, man, our band, 
all we need is a bass player and a singer. And, and maybe it, an acoustic guitar. I'm like, really? Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Might I add, I did I only ever sang like in head voice. Until I came into Yeah, and I had no idea you sang at all until like that May, the first practice, I'm like, what on earth? Yeah, we were planning on doing a cover album for a bit, and then we had, like, we were planning on doing, I think it was like a good upwards to maybe 15 songs. Yeah, it was a lot. It was a lot, but thankfully that fell through. <laughs> I think another part of that was like, we had quite a bit of writer's block. Like we, at least like with how songs sounded, we kind of just were, against the wall, so... Yeah, for sure. But Just focused on refining the ones that we have. Yeah. We do have one that we're thinking will be a single. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yes. single after the EP, probably maybe later this summer. Possibly. I'll play into the fall, winter yeah. time. We'll see. Yeah. We're not the quickest squirrels in the bunch. <laughs> we kind of are learning to... We yeah. have never recorded We're new before. at this. Yeah, yeah. and I mean, we're obvi obviously we're independent, so we have to figure out ways to do most of the stuff ourselves. And especially over quarantine, we, we tried to do Zoom practices together. <laughs> Don't do it. No. Don't that, do that it. Did a bad idea. The delays on each of the computers. <laughs> so really, along. it was like just a meeting. Like, yeah. I, we were, I exist still. <laughs> we, at that time, we were really trying to figure out because we had we had been nameless for a good five months at that point. Yeah. yeah. It so was we, we it really, was torture. We <laughs> trying to find a name. We finally came up with a name. Like, like last band practice. Yeah. Like yes. March thirteenth. Because we're trying to get the band like operational and like out into the public and stuff, and we were like, well, if we're gonna do that, we have to have a name. We yeah. can't. We can't change. Yeah. It. You can't change it again either. Because once you do that, you know that's what people are gonna know you as. You yeah. just gotta. So we'll be uploading on here probably semi regularly, and we took some pictures today. So we'll be getting probably an Instagram and maybe a Facebook, most likely a Twitter, up and running. And then, like, once we have all of our songs recorded, we'll be on Bandcamp and Spotify. Hopefully anywhere you can yeah. listen to music online. Hopefully Amazon and Apple Music as well, if they, I don't know, what the deal is with them. We'll figure it out. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, thanks for watching. Yeah. Please subscribe. <laughs> yeah.